Ready? Yep. Next boat. Yeah, today uh, we're out here getting people on the water to uh, engage in a kayaking cleanup. So it's a it's one of our my favorite programs that we do. Uh, not only do people get to enjoy the water, but they get to help make sure that our waterways are clean. I'm sure are aware um, pollution is a big problem everywhere. Um, and so what we do here really helps because eventually our water will end up in the ocean. So today we're going to be focusing on plastics. Ready to find some litter? Yeah, we're, we're on the hunt today. I'll tell you that much. We'll be successful. Yeah. Really only about 15 or so percent of litter is intentionally thrown. Uh, a lot of it comes from storm water runoff. So when it rains, uh, water wants to find the lowest possible source and that's always, you know, a body of water. So while it's traveling across, you know, impervious services like parking lots and, and rooftops and parks, it's going to pick up not only a lot of trash, um, but also a lot of nutrients, sediment, uh, petroleum products, uh, like oil leaking from a, a, a truck or um, asphalt, asphalt to petroleum products. So it picks all of that up and it deposits it into um, our, our waterways. So that's why these cleanups here are important because that water, you're going to see on the bank a lot of trash that's got a wash in. Something plastic. I love how you start on kayak, but then saw a need to, to take oh, yeah. to land. <laughs> it's all those little things that uh, helps protect this river. And I, I think the compact's doing a great job of getting people involved. And, uh, and that's why the Tennessee Scenic River Association, as a conservation organization, we teach lots of kayaking. Because once, you, once they start to like something in the water, they'll want to preserve it. People preserve that which they enjoy. Found a lot of plastic bottles, and then, uh, you know, there's obviously trash bags that we find as well. And I found two tennis balls. Other than that, I think we made a big impact on this side and area. And yeah, volunteers are a very important part of our work. We value, um, not only their hard work, but their, their spirit. They're so, we have probably one of the best volunteer groups I've worked with. They're so happy to be out and there's never any problems and they are determined, especially on these kayak cleanups. I've seen people haul shopping carts on them, dumpsters, multiple tires. They are determined to get as much as they can, even on a kayak, it's really fun. Well, it was full of, especially right here, it was full of trash. We've pretty much got everything in this area. You can get out, out there once, once a month, once a year, even. Uh, it's you know it's important that we we take care of our water resources because what we, how our, we treat our water here affects people all the way downstream and into the Atlantic Ocean. I guarantee you, there's bottles of water that's been lost into the Cumberland that made it all the way down to the Gulf. Um, so it's important that we keep our waterways around us clean because um, other people's health depends on it.